You've already learned where the manual oxygen addition valve is. But if your solenoid battery ever dies, you may need to maintain manual oxygen additions for a longer period of time. For the purpose of this exercise, we're leaving the set point at 0.7 and bringing the actual PO2 up to 1.0. First, vent some gas from the loop in order to make room for the oxygen molecules, then add small injections of oxygen. Watch the PO2 as you circulate the gas through the loop. It takes a while to mix, so keep breathing, keep circulating the gas through the loop, and keep watching your primary handset as the PO2 starts to rise. Vent some more gas to make room for additional oxygen injections. Be patient. Changes take time. The oxygen injections are small to protect you from over-injecting and overshooting your planned PO2. It could take several minutes to bring the oxygen up to the level desired in a controlled way. Keep breathing to homogenize the gas. Remember, you can check your primary handset, but you can also see actual PO2 with your HUD light displays. Finally, you've reached 1.0. Your metabolism is going to vary how often you're going to need to inject oxygen in order to maintain a stable 1.0. Keep watching your displays if you're ever in manual control.